Hello, this is Mr. Soccer Star 323 here, and I am going to be showing you the basics to making a hat climb. Okay, so pretend you have a brand new MCP. Um, then, so first you're going to want to import private boolean or first import um, this then and this oh, imports like so you can uh, press a toggle keys or hotkey that's what it's called then you're gonna just stay there and you're gonna type Private Boolean key states, brackets, and then semicolon. Then you're going to go down a little bit. Once you start to see this, you're going to type in key st states equals new. I forget. But yeah. Oops. There. Key states equals new boolean fifty six two fifty six in brackets and then semicolon. Then you're gonna stay there and just paste this in. Um yeah. So then for the last thing and the easiest you're just gonna get here and type else. So kind of right above all the XYZ stuff and type else. Then you can actually start to do all the other stuff. So I'll show you how to make a, a key toggle. So first right click here and then new class and then you're going to want to call it variables. Well, I spell it wrong all the time on purpose. It's just quicker for me. And then you're going to want to click on variables class and type in for the hack you want to make. Type public static boolean and then hack name equals false. Well, equals false if you want it always. If you want it off when you start, or on if you want it on when you start. So let's call ours no fall, because I'll add that later. Equals false. Then cool. Actually, we're going to add the seed. Equals um, let's make it true. Okay, so then you're going to go back to, oh, you need to start all of this, GUI in game. You can tell right there. So you're going to want to first, well, right under this else, you're going to type if, then, uh, I forget what those are called, but it's 9 and 0 if you shift click them. Um, if you type if, check capital K and key, and capitals do matter, so you have to get it right. Then another, I'll call it 0, 9, um, shift 0, 9. Then you're going to type keyboard.key. S G S and put some brackets right there so there's a space in between. You're gonna type variables or you're gonna type this class name. So mine is variables.java variables. Let me just delete this. Variables dot 
seed equals exclamation mark variables dot seed and then semicolon and yeah so that'll that'll make it so if you press s then wait no we don't want an s that's back let's make it l so if you press l then it'll the seed will pop up and now you're gonna want to um, uh, go outside of the bracket right here and go up to if and variables dot seed then make some brackets and open it up variables dot seed then what do we want it to we want it to show the seed so this is the seed so when you press F3 this is the seed and so it shows seed and it says MC dot the world gets seed and then right here it says where it should be and here is the color so if we wanted it actually here's what we're gonna do to make the color actually no mind let's make the color um let me go to a quick um color code color codes so let's make it 00FF33. Actually, let's make it 0000FF. Okay. Um, so 0000FF. And capitals do not matter for this. But you, it's easier just to do whatever you want and so this right here is how many over it should be so right now it's two but let's make it let me see where the coordinates are so they're 130 over let's try 200 200 over and we only need it two down so if you save that and then click the green start button then it will run the game and um, we press what was it L oh I have it set to true but so you see that doesn't work so but the seed is right here so we need to also one handy thing to do when you're trying to figure out where you want it you can run it in debug mode that will make it so you can edit things while the game is running is super handy so let's try 250 250 oh yeah and save command s or for windows control s and yeah that's perfect Then if you press L, the seed will disappear and appear. Yeah, and then if you go on another world, the seed will be different. Turn the full bright. 